Hey what's up guys it's your boy Half Life and today I'm going to be teaching you how to do this in under 5 minutes. It might look complicated but it isn't. All you need is two images that is the main character and the background. For the main character today I'm going to be using Fade as she's the newest agent dropping soon in Valorant and the background is going to be one of a uh, video's teaser which I took a snapshot of and both the images will be linked in the description so if you want to replicate it go ahead. Uh, and it will save you some time for the PNG. So starting off, we're going to be using the PNG of Fade. Since there is no actual PNG officially available, I already cropped it out myself and you can just download this in the description and let's start off. So first you go to file, create new and then create a 1920 by 1080 canvas with 100 pixels resolution. It's going to be an empty canvas. Now all you have to do is drag and drop the PNGs. Uh, we have one of the PNGs here and I'm going to be using the background as well. I've dragged and dropped it also. We're going to be dragging it down now. So now all you have to do is resize the main character as per your requirements. You can resize it how much ever you want. But I feel like this size actually is perfect since the main character is standing out. Right now we are almost done actually. So you can see the background and you can see the main character. But the colors are kind of not matching because there's a lot of red in the background and the main character doesn't have red that much. So what we this is the main part of the video where you can actually spice up the image to the next level. So go here to the round button and click on it. You get a option called gradient map and this will completely change the color of your image. It'll have two sides, but we are adding one in the middle. And this is the uh, side in the middle. So here we're going to let the most corner right side as white. But here we're going to go to a greenish, greenish black color, which will set the vibe of the image. And here we're going to go with something, a peach kind of color, but a little more dark darker peach as you can see here and this is almost it you're almost done but one thing which which will set up at your uh, image is basically blurring the background so that your main character does stand out even though the colors are similar so go to filter and go to blur and add gaussian blur i would like like a two pixels of a blur that would be perfect for me and once i add it you will see there's a difference between the main character and the background even though the colors are similar and that's it we are we are done and it only took us three minutes I, I would say you can do it under five for the first time but yeah since i already did it before it took under three minutes and you can always play around with the gradient map by just clicking on this and then clicking the main color off to a different color maybe Oh yeah, this would look good as well, but you can choose any color. It would take under five minutes and you have something which you can use as a thumbnail or a wallpaper if you want to. And um, yeah, that's it for the video guys. Hope you enjoyed it. It took two layers and one gradient map to perform this. Um, so yeah, do get subscribed if you haven't already and um, do drop a like if you enjoyed the video and I'll see you in the next one. Thank you.